Yo guy PPT fans, this is Mulverney on the move. Right now I'm at the X CNE 2012. Right now I'm inside the Rico Coliseum. Beside me is two-time Olympian silver medalist Elvis Stoiko. So Elvis, now today you're performing. Uh, how is it different from your um, your competition? Like the, the show, what does the audience expect to see? Well, it's totally different than competing. You don't have the stress of trying to get all the jumps done. So in this program that I'm doing here, it's it's got most of my tricks and it's more right for the crowd. I get really connected to them. I stop, I do the high fives, I really connect with them, and, and it's all about the exhibition and the showmanship rather than just getting the elements done to try to get the marks and impress the judges and all that sort of thing. I, I did years of that, the competitive circuit. Uh, you know, I'm racing go-karts now, so I've got that competitive side, but for skating now, it's just strictly for the show. Have a great time, get the people up standing and clapping, and, and when they leave, they felt like they've had a great time and were entertained. So what does it feel like to come back home and show into a home crowd with a performance with um, the Canadian soil? Oh, it's great. I mean, I've, I travel all around the world from Europe to the States to Japan, all over, but it's always nice to be back at home. There's always a, sort of the big, uh, the big warm family hug when, it, when I get out there. It's, uh, today was my first one. Um, Tessa and Scott were skating for, for most of the CNE, and I have the last weekend here. But um, you know, as soon as I get out there, and they don't even announce my name, I get out and I can feel everyone. They know who I am. I get a recognizable face. And, and you know, even walking through the X, uh, people come up and say hi and stuff. Even the young kids, uh, thanks, thanks to social media and YouTube, they can watch stuff way back before they were even born. So that's actually pretty cool. But uh, no, it's just it's awesome to have that, uh, like I said, the big family hug when I first step out there. And, it, and it's great to skate for them. Elvis, when you're hungry after a skating program, you go to a Pizza Pizza store. What's your favorite topics? What's Elvis' Pizza Pizza slice? Oh, it depend, depends on what I feel like. Sometimes I'm like in the meat lover's mode, so I just throw all the meat on it, and then I have either the gluten-free or I'll have the whole wheat uh, thin crust. Uh, sometimes I'm in just veggie mode. I'll have like tomatoes and peppers. I love peppers. It could be green peppers, red peppers, yellow peppers, whatever. So Elvis, like what kind of encouragement or recommendations for you for the younger generation want to get into the skating world and uh, trying to get their uh, foot wet into the field? Well, the biggest thing, um, not just in skating, but in anything is you gotta, you gotta be yourself. You really gotta, you gotta be, you gotta break the mold. Um, and just be yourself because there's always that picture that they wanted me to be in back in skating They wanted me to be a softer balletic type of skater They wanted me to fit that typical skater that they wanted from the 80s and the early 90s and I didn't fit that Thanks for having me uh, being interviewing. No, thanks for coming. It's awesome. And get yourself a slice of pizza right now because it's really good. To be in the next Mulverney video, visit pptv.ca.